Alright, PlayStation Doom Reloaded, map 36. Bone crunching. Oh boy. This is a big map. 215 enemies. Lots of head scatters. Early on, at least. So. Let's snipe. Snipe them off, at least. I think there is a chain gunner in here. Yeah, you might want to get rid of him. And then there are some guys uh, inside that building over there. You might actually be able to snipe some of them off through this window. Well, might as well take those bullets. And from here you can find the SSG. But, it's a trap. Let's kill that guy, and let's get ready for it. That went well. And now we can snipe some of these guys from here. Oh. <laughs> And then, let's go through here. Let's kill these lost souls first. And listen carefully. There's a monster clever opening up behind you. So you might want to keep an eye on these guys. Yeah, you guys keep doing that. I'll be fine. Perfect. And there are so many ways to go here. Because the main complex of this map is quite unlinear, so you can go... Like, there are just so many ways to go. And I think there is a secret switch in here. It will open up a secret area nearby. With a megasphere. And this is where the Megasphere's at, with some Nightmare Imps. We will clear it, clear out the secret now, at least out of all the monsters, so all of the monsters should be killed. And then I'll spare the Megasphere for later, and... Well, that was kinda unnecessary, but fortunately it's not as bad as it looks. And then there's this different wall texture in here that you should use, if I remember correctly. Yeah, it's right there, if you need it. But we don't need it yet. And this will take us back out here. Let's take care of these guys. Now we have 400 bullets, and this will lead to the red door, I believe, from what I remember. Yes. Yeah, this is where the red door is. But we don't have the key yet. Let's use this one, so... Yeah, this is where the last horde of shotgun guys are at. So, let's get rid of them. And this is also where you can find the rocket launcher from. So it's a pretty dark and kind of a... Dark tech-based map. And I believe there is actually a room around here with that few monsters, so you might want to check out this room too. 
try there. And let's go back here now. But at the same time, uh, you'll get a plenty of shells in which one. Hey, who is that? Yeah, it's... It's the Revenants, for the first time. You might want to watch out for those guys, as they do their double missile thing. I think there was a switch in here somewhere. I think it's this one that opens this secret. It's a little bit like <laughs> from uh, the Crusher with the barrels and stuff. Here we have some cells instead, and a box of rockets. No Megasphere, but it's a pretty looking room nevertheless. Alright. I think we're done with this half of the map. I just want to make sure the main complex is clear. So we, we don't get any surprises here. And now there's this one little door that I need to find. I think it's uh, this one. Yeah, this is the one. This will take you to the red key. Yeah, plenty of helmets. There's a soul sphere. It doesn't really matter uh, from which side you'll start this from. So you keep using these switches. And we're just gonna ignore everything for now. There we go. Now, there's the red key. Let's use this one and... Yeah, there we go. And now we can deal with the imps. Perfect. Oh, damn it. And now we can go check. We can go and check these rooms. Damn it, do I need to start SG'ing everything? <laughs> I'm having like 100 shells the whole time. But it's good, it's good. I'm not coming. Well, might as well take that. Because there's the Megasphere. I'm gonna spare that for later. Mmm. Rockets. Mmm, I probably won't be needing that. Or... Maybe I could. Who knows? Alright, and let's get out of here. There's a backtrack teleporter around here. I'll take those. And now... The red door awaits. I'm still struggling to remember where it is. Yeah, here it is. Yeah, this guy's nasty. Oh, thank you for taking thinking about me, Mr. Chain Gunner. Don't fall off because you can't get out. And of course, just in time, the invisibility ran out. Because I remember that there were some hit scanners in here, but the invisibility just ran out. All 
rat, then we'll go inside this building if needed, but first, let's snap out these guys. Yeah, those Hell Knights, I can deal with them later. As long as there are some imps and shotgun guys, I'll probably do what to deal with them first. Yeah, I think he probably died already. And now, let's take these. And there's actually a secret nearby. But let's kill these guys first. And there should be a monster closet here. Let's use this little wall here. And then you'll gain access to this secret with a computer or a map in it. It will probably help you to find the rest of the secrets too. Alright, time to deal with those Hell Knights then. Oh damn it, there's a chain gun or two. Yay! The blue key. I'll be just gathering these pickups here. Hmm. Don't remember if there was anything here, aside from health. Uh, nope. Yeah, I think we're done with this area. So, there's the blue dome. It's right here. This is a teleporter. And it's kind of a backtracker. And then take these stairs. And these blue torches uh, should be a good indicator as well. So they kind of indicate the... Or they share the same color with the door and the key. What? And this is where the exit is. It's a pretty open room. Uh, I went to stay back because there were some revenants. I think there might be one or two of them. Yeah, that guy is somewhat tricky because he, he likes to stay usually on that side, so it's a little bit challenging. And there are still some enemies remaining. Not much. And I think there should be one more shotgun guy inside this room. And this is where the exit is, but we still have some secrets to look for. And probably the toughest secret by far to find is... Uh, it's this one. You need to use this piece of wall right here to lower a nearby plasma gun. It's by far the toughest secret. It's this one right there. Alright. Two secrets. Let me think. Oh yeah, there's the invisibility secret that I missed. It's actually around here. It's here. It's some rockets. And then there's the megasphere secret too. Which is over here, which just... I believe it hasn't been tagged yet? Alright, now it's tagged. We got everything. Oh, what? We got one monster remaining. What is this? I think it's probably some dude around some corner. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so, turns out that we ha we'll probably have to go look for him. I to be honest, don't know. I don't have the slightest idea where he's at. But fortunately, we can conveniently uh, do the final hoarding thing at the same time, so we can just you know move around the map and gather item items as we go. So there's that, and hopefully we'll uh, come across this monster wherever he might be at. I think it's probably like a specter or something. Probably. Uh, there's actually this suspiciously looking corner uh, located uh, in the northeastern corner of the map. It's around here somewhere. Yeah, it's here. Yeah, I knew it. <laughs> yeah, that was the last enemy. 
All right. Some shells and some bullets. That's what we need. Well, I guess that's fine. Because uh, I went through the red door area already, so I don't think there's anything there. So I think we're good. And as long as I have... Uh, oh. 371. Damn, I would be tempted to get 400 now. But... Mm, this area doesn't have anything anymore, I believe. Because I went through all of the rooms where the Hell Knights were. Where the big horde of Hell Knights were. So... I'm just gonna sec that set room, the center room. Might be some clips here. Right, we're leaving. And of course it's the wrong way. <laughs> I just hate it when I'm instantly like thinking that the exit of this map is located in the north when it's not. <laughs> Kind of annoying habit of mine. All right. Nothing in here. Yeah, we're all good. Let's get out of here. Yeah, that's bone crunching. Wow, 16 minutes. And this is only the sixth level. The next map is also quite big, but let's focus on this level for now. So. Mm, the first really big map, plenty of hit scanners around, the main complex uh, that will drain your health a little bit over time. Mm. And then there is the big horde of Hell Knights. Mm, but they can be mostly ignored as you probably saw during the video, so they are just, you know, seemingly uh, a massive threat that can be just ignored mostly by running around and using them switches and, and stuff. And then of course we got uh, the Revenants. A um, couple of them actually. The first one is not actually that difficult uh, if uh, he doesn't see you, but the guy inside the exit area or behind the blue door can be quite nasty. And also the one, also the one behind the red door is kind of nasty because he's slightly in a distance, so you might want to take him out with a rocket launcher really quickly, but I didn't do so because I'm, um, you know, ult ultimately, uh, you know, the ammo saver type of a player, so I don't really use ammo for, like, or I would say I would use rockets if I had, like, 100 rockets or so, but the red door guy has actually caused some severe damage to me many times, and also same applies to the guy uh, the revenant inside the exit area or behind the blue door. So that guy can be quite nasty. But again, definitely a step up in difficulty and most importantly, step up in size. But at the same time, we did have a soul sphere uh, and uh, we did have a mega sphere and there's plenty of ammo. It's just that those hit scatters can drain your health quickly. And those revenants too. Those are probably the greatest threats that you will face here. So, it's a good map. So, let's move on to map 37, Power Station. And I think there's a little story stuff going on here. Uh, with some typos, I believe. So, <laughs> need to fix these in the next, next release. And for some reason, the GZ Doom text thing goes like super fast, and it's kind of hard to read all of that. So I wouldn't even bother reading this because when you play Vanilla Doom, it goes slower and it's it's way more easier to read. But yeah, this is map 37, Power Station. I was almost gonna say Power Control, but uh, I'm glad I didn't. But Needless to say, this map takes ins draws some inspiration from Power Control and some other levels. But more about this map once we get there, so thanks for the company and see you around.